It is Friday, um, I'm at home, but I'm gonna be going to Tyler's a little bit later on and I've got a lot to do today, so I better get moving. So typically what I've been doing for the past few weeks is I've been uh, making a video throughout the weekend, um, editing it on the Wednesday and the Thursday, sort of those days, getting it uploaded on the Thursday and ready to go on the Friday when it uploads at 4 p.m. This week I haven't done that. I edited it a little bit later on in the week, didn't really have chance to upload it up until now, and it's meant to go live a little bit later on today. Still haven't made a thumbnail, still haven't actually put the title and set all that stuff up on there, so I'm gonna get all that sorted now. I also have to go down to the garage in a little bit and pick up my car. Um, I have an MOT on it tomorrow, so it needs new tires on there. Gonna go down there and pick that up because I took that down a little bit earlier on this morning. Right, okay, so car's all sorted now. Got new tyres on every wheel. When I actually took it to the garage, um, the guy who uh, did the tyres essentially said that there's a knocking coming from the right-hand side. It's been happening for a few weeks now and I've known about it, but I didn't actually know what it was. So it looks as though it's one of the actual ball joints that's gone. So it is probably gonna fail its MOT tomorrow. Uh, I've got that booked in for tomorrow morning. Um, but it should be something that's quite easy to fix when, when I actually take it for the MOT. Uh, gonna head down to Tyler's now. We've got an Apple Genius appointment in, in an hour or so. So gonna head down there now and, uh, and we'll be back at mine a little bit later on. Now about this noise that it seems to be making, this knocking noise, it's coming from the bottom right hand side uh, from the front wheel. Um, it's literally, it's as I turn the steering wheel, it just seems to be making a knocking noise. And it's only when I'm driving sort of really slowly that you can hear it, but see if you can listen out for it now. Actually, I think you can definitely hear that. It just seems to be making that noise a lot of the time when I'm driving around. It's something that I've known about, so I did expect this to be a, an issue um, with the MLT, something that I was gonna have to have to get sorted. The place where I'm taking it tomorrow, it's a place near me, um, they actually do cover um, retests. So I'm gonna take it down tomorrow. I'll get an MLT test. I know it will fail because the knocking on the front should be able to get that sorted and obviously check if there's any other issues there as well. And then we should be good to get it sorted. So this is why we've come to the Apple store. So the volume buttons just do not work on it anymore at all. And then right down the bottom corner there, that green part, they're dead pixels. So it's just, it's just not working. It's not cracked at all, it's just... It's not great. We're just coming out of um, the Arndale now. So they ended up actually doing like a, a diagnos diagnostics on it. And it turns out that there were actually some issues with like the, um, what was it? The compass, the compass and the speaker. And Apple, Apple Pay as well. Yeah, and the Apple Pay. I didn't, I didn't realize that. Well. And they basically just replaced it for free. So he's got a new iPhone for free. And um, you're happy? Yeah. Cool. Did I pay for it? No, absolutely free. So that saved you 100 quid. So we're just back at Tyler's house now. He's just set up his phone and we're more or less ready to head back to mine. We're just gonna pack a few things here and then yeah, we're gonna head back to the car and uh, go back to mine. We're staying at mine tomorrow and the day after, so Saturday and Sunday. Ready? Yeah. I just realized that I shot that then, Tyler, and I shot the entire thing in the wrong frame rate. <laughs> so. Again. Again. So we're at the car park now. Oh. <laughs> I'm tapping it back. So we're at the car park now. Um, Tyler's just having a smoke. We're gonna um, go to Tesco on the way back as well because I don't think I'm gonna get my car this weekend. I don't think I'm gonna get it back. Um, there's definitely a few things that are wrong with it. So it's gonna take at yeah. least, yeah. There's like, there is. So it's gonna take a bit of time for them to fix it anyway. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna leave it in there over the weekend. So I wanna go to Tesco tonight, get a few drinks and things like that. So then I don't really have to worry about that through the rest of the weekend. 
I'm censoring you. Ah. <laughs> Just do that. No. See you in a bit. See you in a Bye. So it is the it's the next day now. We've come down to a golf course near uh, mine. It's a really, really nice day out. So we just thought we'd just come out and spend most of the day outside. The golf course, I think, is actually still closed at the moment, but there's like a path that we know, or that I know, uh, that's near my house that you can sort of take to just come down here. So that's what we've done. We've sort of just taken the, the, the secret sort of path to get down here. We've got a blanket set up up there and we're just sort of chilling out and we're just gonna basically enjoy the sun because uh, if you know anything about England, it doesn't last very long. So, uh, so that's basically all we're doing today. I took my car down for its MOT a little bit earlier on this morning and uh, it actually passed. I don't know what that noise is that it's making but um, it's obviously nothing nothing as serious as I thought. It is staying in the shop until Tuesday though. What they're going to do is they're going to have a look and see if they can actually figure out what that noise is and they'll get back to me with that. So uh, that's something to deal with a little bit later on in the week. Um, but yeah, we're just going to enjoy the sun today. Uh, have a bit of a chill day. <laughs> That's the first time I've crashed this drone and there is literally not a single scratch on it anywhere. Been here for like a few hours now. Um, we're gonna start heading back to my house. I think we've got tea like in like an hour or so.